Do you feel stuck as if you're going nowhere? You may very well be in a holding pattern. So let's talk about that. Hi everyone, welcome to Mana for Thought. You are doing everything you're supposed to do, but you can't seem to get from one point to the next. You know what you want and where you should be, but you can't seem to get there. You are in a holding pattern. The holding pattern is the flight path maintained by an aircraft awaiting permission to land. But in your case, it's a state or period of no progress or change. You feel unevolved in your career, in your ministry, or in life itself. You feel as if you are in limbo. We want change to come, and we want it now. But in a holding pattern, the pilot takes instructions from the air traffic controller to wait for his permission to land. So like the pilot, we are to wait on God's instructions and stay focused on his promises. This is not an easy place to be in life. I would know because I am in that same position right now and it can be exhausting. There's discouragement, worry, fear, and deep uncertainties in that holding pattern. But it is in these times that God wants us to be to wait patiently on him and be anxious for nothing. Like Paul, we have to learn how to be content in God regardless of our circumstances. The pilot is always in constant communication with the controller who issues the holding instructions. So the pilot can understand the plan of action. God knows the plans that he has for our lives. He said it in his word, thoughts of peace and not of evil. You know the promises that God made to you. Why do you think they've changed? Like the pilot, we need to be in continuous communication with God, being reassured of his promises. One of the most common reasons for a holding status is the weather condition. Unexpected storms can appear in our lives. Death, sickness, unemployment, broken relationships, fears, and failures. You may be in a holding pattern because God wants to protect you from the storms of life. He knows what lies ahead. If you find yourself struggling in a holding pattern like myself, I want to ask you the same question that was asked of me. Have you not known? Have you not heard? The everlasting God, the Lord, the creator of the ends of the earth, neither faints nor is weary. His understanding is unsearchable. He gives power to the weak and to those who have no might, he increases their strength. Even the youth shall faint and be weary and the young men shall utterly fall. But those who wait on the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagle. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. This is not the time for you to lose sight of what God is doing in your life. Wait on the Lord, be of good courage, and he shall direct your path. I'm Alison Cornelius, and thank you for joining me on Mana for Thought.